So how do you capture professional sounding audio for your videos? How do you capture clean, crisp sounds that help raise the production value of your videos and help take your content to the next level? Well, in this video, I've got five simple tips for better sounding audio. It's coming up. Hey everyone, Steve here from Learn Online Video. And today we're talking all about how you can capture professional sounding audio for your videos. These are beginner tips, perfect if you're just starting out. Now there are many ways to capture audio in your videos. You could use one of these, for example, this is a lavalier mic or lapel mic. These just clip onto your collar. You see these on TV shows, live events, and are perfect in interview situations. Or if you're looking for something a bit more versatile then a shotgun microphone like this one here is a great option. These microphones sit on top of your camera and they are directional microphones, meaning they're designed to pick up audio that's directly in front of them and cancel out or reduce sound coming from the back and sides. Compared to say a lapel mic, which is an omnidirectional microphone, meaning it is designed to pick up sounds coming in from all directions or anything within its proximic bubble. So tip number one is to choose a microphone that will best suit your needs. Really try to avoid using the internal microphone on your camera. Yes, it's better than nothing, but generally speaking, the internal microphone on your camera will sound like a huge pile of sh so if you're serious about video and looking to up your game, then consider investing in an external microphone like this one here. This will dramatically increase the quality of your audio. This is the Cinco Mic M3, by the way. You can pick this up on Amazon for around about $79 or 61 British pounds. But as always, I will link all gear used in this video, including this microphone in the description below. Now, once you've got your microphone, it's important to use it correctly. And this goes back to understanding the difference between various microphones. For example, here is a mistake that I see people making often. They'll have their camera, they'll have their microphone sat on top of their camera. They'll be walking around, filming, talking, very common with travel filmmakers or vloggers, but pay close attention to the microphone that you're using and the direction in which it is facing. Remember, shotgun microphones are designed to pick up audio from the front and reduce sounds coming from the back and sides. So if you ever find yourself in a situation like this where you're talking to the camera, then simply turn the microphone around so that you're talking straight into it. This will massively improve the quality of your audio and make your videos sound much, much better. Okay, tip number three, accessories. You can very easily diversify your microphone by simply adding to it. Take this five pound extension cable, for example. My microphone is no longer restricted to the top of my camera, and this unlocks the ability to use the microphone in interview situations. Simply screw your microphone onto a boom pole or selfie stick like this one here, and you're now able to hold your microphone nice and close to your subject without your microphone getting in the shot. Super cheap accessory, massively improves your audio. Okay, tip number four, monitor your audio. If your camera has a headphone jack, then be sure to use it. Hearing the audio that you're capturing is the best way to ensure that you're capturing it correctly. Use the audio monitor on your LCD screen if you have one. Being able to see your audio is another great way to check that everything is working as it should. Adjust your audio levels so that nothing is peaking or going into the red, and always do a test before you shoot just to make sure that everything is sounding as it should. Okay, tip number five, understand your environment. The environment that you're in will massively determine how your audio sounds. If you're outside like this, for example, in a nice open space, chances are you're not gonna get any air. Whereas if you go inside into a small empty room, then the chances are your audio is going to sound echoey and terrible. Try to avoid filming in locations with lots of background noise. Make life easier on yourself in the edit by doing what you can to reduce issues. For example, Use a dead cat to prevent audio distortion on a windy day. Use a pop filter when recording voiceovers for a much more professional sound and stick acoustic foam to your walls and ceiling if you have the option, as this will really help capture great echoless sounding audio. So look, I really hope these tips have helped you get a better understanding of how to capture more professional sounding audio in your videos. If it has, do let me know, give this video the old thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more content like this, learn more about video production, then you can do that by watching one of my other videos just over there. But that's it from me. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.